Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some different bars for you. I have the Bear Bells, which we have reviewed Bear Bells in the past, uh, but these are soft protein bars. That's the difference. Uh, this is a caramel choco, and this is a salted peanut caramel. And I have the Alani protein bar, and this one is the peanut butter and jelly. So the Alani was $2.99, and the Bear Bells were $3.29, and they were all bought at the vitamin shop. So is yours like a lot smaller or something? Mine is 1.94 ounces. Mine's 1.83 ounces. So, so mine's just a little bit. Smaller. Yeah, well, it's a, yeah, definitely cheaper. Okay, so when we bought these soft protein bars, these Bear Bells, and they were in the grocery hall, I had a lot of people tell me that they're, they really liked them because of the, the texture. Mm -hmm. So it says, Soft protein bar, caramel choco, 16 grams of protein, no added sugar. It is 190 calories. Not bad. And it says manufactured for Bear Bells in Los Angeles, California. So how much protein do these have? These have... I was just curious. Soft protein bar, 16 grams of protein. <laughs> yeah. That's what you're eating for. <laughs> yes, it's for the protein, yeah. Okay. It looks sticky. Yeah, and it looks like a slab of caramel. It does look like actual caramel. All right. Wherever you want that. <laughs> and it does yeah. have a coating on it. Yeah, it literally has like like gooey caramel on the inside. Yeah, it's, it's a little sticky on the bottom. That caramel, it's a really thin layer. That kind of reminds me of a, um, did a Mars bar, a Milky Way? What's that candy bar that has the caramel on top and it's kind of got a nougat in the middle, but it's kind of firm? It's a Milky Way. Milky Way? Yeah, that's what that reminds me of. Not flavor wise or anything, just texture. Someone's got a text. I left my sound on. I apologize. First rule of doing a food review. Is Professional turn, YouTubers. Yeah, turn your sound <laughs> on. I have to say that hasn't happened very many times. No, no. I'm usually pretty good at that. Um, go ahead. When I first put it in my mouth, I immediately tasted the protein. Oh yeah. But it did get better from there. So, once you get over that initial protein flavor, I do think you got the sweetness from the caramel, you got some sweetness from the, cho the chocolate coating. Um, I do like it. I like that, that it's soft. I, I do like that quite a bit. I could definitely eat this protein bar. Yeah, it, it does remind you of like a Milky Way kind of bar, except it's more dense, mm -hmm. uh, a little more dense. I did also get the protein flavor. It stuck around a little bit for me, but for the most part, it tastes like caramel. It's, it doesn't have a really strong caramel flavor to me. But it is caramel. It's you definitely caramel. It's, it's just caramel. not like a, with all the caramel that's there, you would think it, if it was a real caramel, it would be like really rich and buttery and you know, all this stuff. This was not like that, but it is caramel flavor. There are a lot of kind of reminds you of a, of a Brock's caramel flavor a little bit. Right. Yes. The squares. There are a lot of protein bars though that we have reviewed and said, no way. I couldn't eat that. No, it's, it's too, too strong. much, too yeah. strong. That I could absolutely oh, yeah. eat. Yeah, I could definitely eat this one. I, I, I like the texture. I like the flavor of it and the protein flavor. While it stuck around a little bit, wasn't near what other ones are. Okay, this one's more calories. It's the same amount of protein. This is the salted peanut caramel, and it still has 16 grams of protein and no added sugar, but it's 210 calories, which shouldn't surprise us because... Um, you know, peanuts. Yeah, the peanuts is not that I don't know. I know. It sucks, too, up. because I absolutely love peanuts. Um, well, this one is not. It leaked on one end and you handed it to me. <laughs> she had to lay the sticky end it's right like in It's like when I hand you the scissors. With the yeah, with the point towards me. Hoping I'll like, don't do that. Don't hand it with the point out. Turn them around. Okay, so salted peanut caramel. This has a lighter filling. You know that caramel is sticky as can be. Mm-hmm. You you have to lick your finger a little. 
it comes off pretty easily. Mm -hmm. It's just when you get it on your finger, it's sticky. It just wipes, but it wipes right off. So it's not like a regular phone where it sticks to your skin like mad. With this bar, I'm having the same thing happen that I did with the first one. The, um, I, I get the protein, but I also get a peanut. So there was protein mixed with peanut. But then as you're chewing it, I think the peanut flavor comes through more and more. I don't necessarily get a strong caramel. No, it's um, all peanut. It's, no. it's all peanut, no. yeah. It's, and it's just raw peanut. It's yes, it doesn't taste like peanut butter. Mm -hmm. It's just peen like peanut, like dry roasted peanut. And, and yeah. I wish they'd been a little bit stronger on the salt. Oh. I mean, I got a little salt, but I like, I like things salty. When I eat a peanut, I like it salty. I, I like thought them. this one was a tad bit chewier than the first one. Yeah, the nougat part was a little. Yeah. So yeah, so I do think as far as uh, softness goes, and that could vary when you buy them. It could be when they're made or whatever. Yeah. So you might have the exact opposite experience. Um, but for our experience, I think the caramel choco was softer. Yeah, um, I like the flavor of the caramel one better. I do too. Overall. That's the one I would choose. So out of the two, if I were to buy these Bear Bells, I would buy the chocolate, the caramel chocolate. Yeah, not that I don't, I, not that I dislike the peanut butter one. Peanut's the not peanut the one, peanut. It's not bad. It's just raw peanut. Yeah, That's I all wish you're the, if the caramel had come through a little bit stronger, it would have been better. I agree. But, but just, like I said, even in the first one, the caramel's a lighter flavor anyway. Mm -hmm. So it didn't take much to overcome that flavor, and the peanuts just just overrule it. Uh, this Alani protein bar is new. They also had another, uh, they have another new flavor, but it was not in stock. Uh, so the vitamin shop was out at the time we went, and it's a place we don't go very often. It's about 45 minutes away from us, but it's just, we just don't go there very often. And uh, so they did not have it. And then I went in G GNC, and they didn't have them at all. Yeah. So they had the Alani gummies, but they didn't have uh, they didn't have the bars. Um, no, that GNC we go into though, it almost looks like they've they've unstocked it and tried to restock everything and just can't get anything in. It's I know. Like missing a ton I stuff. know. I think the location at the mall is much it's more. It's better stocked than yeah. the one that we go into. Yeah. Um, but it's like, do we? You want to park and go in the mall? You know. Um, but this one is a Lonnie protein bar. It's peanut butter and jelly. It has 15 grams of protein and it's 220 calories. And these are manufactured for Alani in Louisville, Kentucky. So uh, AlaniNew.com. Yeah, and all the, the drinks that they make, the Alani drinks, all that is made in, in Louisville. So Just this a few one hours away. is very pale. Yeah, that does not look appetizing. <laughs> oh, I don't think it looks bad. I don't. To me, that looks more like a caramel color than the Bear Bells. It looks like a floater to me. I don't think it looks bad at all. <laughs> um, I did. Um, I think it's just the the little bumpy texture on it. Before we started the video, I, I was very curious. It says peanut butter and jelly. It does have something in there. So red. Uh, right. So I wanted to know. I looked. I wanted to know. Are we gonna have strawberry, grape, raspberry? What kind of jelly is this? I've read the ingredients probably four times and I don't see any jelly in there whatsoever. Like none, like no flavoring, like strawberry flavoring. What? I, I, it's not in the ingredients. You're, so I, I, this is gonna be a surprise. It does taste like jelly. However they've done it. That was a much chewier bar than the, than the other ones. Mm -hmm. I held it up. You can kind of see there's a line of red. Or it could be purple, but I think it's red. What kind of jelly is that? It tastes like strawberry to me. I think you could say just about anything. I think it tastes like strawberry. Mm. But it does have a sweetness like a jelly would. Mm -hmm. You know what's weird about that is I really don't get the peanut butter. Mm -mm. It's all jelly and protein bar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I yeah. like it. I do too. I think it's very good. Mm -hmm. It is funny that... But it also tastes like protein bar. Um, I yeah. get that. I'm getting less. Of course, those the Bear Bells are 16 uh, grams of protein. This is 15. You wouldn't think it would make that big of a difference. 
I'm not getting the protein at all in oh, this really? one. Not that's at all. I, I think that's good too. Yeah. Cause I am getting a little, it's not bad. It's just, I am getting a little. Mm -hmm. Well, it's called peanut butter and jelly. I'm only getting the jelly. Yeah, no peanut butter. I don't know what kind of or jelly peanuts. it is. It's a very sweet, hmm. I wouldn't say it's necessarily strawberry like you. Yeah, it comes across But I wouldn't necessarily call, it's definitely not grape. No. But for me. But it's not raspberry or anything like that. No, either. it's so not raspberry. No, or it's, cherry or anything. No, it definitely tastes, if I had to guess the flavor, I would say strawberry. But it doesn't taste like a candy strawberry. No. Mm. So, so, but it's definitely not grape or raspberry or cherry. No, it's none of those. So I would say, yes, that's the closest. But it's just weird that that is not in the ingredients at all. And it I doesn't put, have strawberry flavoring or anything. No, and I put the pictures at the end of the video if you want to pause. Because, uh, you know, maybe I'm just blind. But I've literally read through here many, many, many times and I don't see it. Uh, but the, it's just so funny that you don't taste the peanut butter at all. Mm -hmm. Just jelly yeah. and And I think sweets. they've thrown some peanuts in there, but I, I don't Because you think that whole bottom part would be like a peanut butter flavor. It's kind of a brownish color. Mm -hmm. Well, I sure don't taste it. It does say peanut flavored coating. And then it does have uh, peanut butter. There is actual peanut yeah, butter just, in it. You just don't get it. And... Um, Peanuts, it says. Yeah. So there are peanuts. Yeah, I got the texture of the peanuts. I just never got any got real the flavor. flavor. Yeah, exactly. But do I, I buy that one. do I like this bar? Yes, I like it very much. And honestly, it's I like it more than any of the too. other ones. So even though you can't taste the peanut butter, it still has a really nice sweet mm -hmm. that sweet jelly yeah. flavor. I actually like it better uh, because of the jelly flavor. I like that. I do taste the the protein a little bit more, but but I still like the jelly. But the other one, the the, the peanut butter or the peanut one, the peanut butter, I would I wouldn't buy that one at all. And the caramel chocolate I like, but it's very sticky and kind of uh, I don't know. The caramel's not very strong. I wish the caramel was a stronger flavor, and I probably would have picked it. But since it's not, I'm going to pick the jelly one. Right. So you just you have to uh, see what you have available in your area. I know if you go to Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's sells some bear bells. I don't know if they sell these though. I right. haven't been in there for a while, so I I, I don't, I'm not sure. But if you can get the new Alani bar somewhere, hopefully it's not just at the vitamin shop, then I would definitely give that a try. And if you can find that other flavor, it's like, I don't know, I want to say s'mores or something like that. But uh, that's probably worth a try too, because just because this one was so good. Uh, but I will have those pictures for you at the end. And thanks for watching.